Welcome back to the Ghost Key. I am Gray, and today we're continuing through Team Rocket's little fucking hizzy and shit here and whatnot and stuff. Right? Anyhow, we might actually get to Giovanni by the end of this episode. But I don't know. I mean, maybe, maybe not. Yeah, this fucking Andrew. That's key. He's gonna fuck our chode up. We're gonna get the hell out of this motherfucker right now. Right now. But anyhow, I'm really, I really need to go look and see when Sandshrew learns motherfucking uh, Earthquake. There, there we go. That's what I'm looking for. That's what I'm looking for. Earthquake. We need Earthquake. That's what we need. We need fucking Earthquake. Because it's good. Otherwise, I gotta go teach him Dig. And, I mean, I have no qualms or quarrels about that. I mean, he'd be pretty good with Dig, but, you know. Earthquake, obviously, is better. Although, I like Dig a lot. But Dig is one of those things, I think I said this before, where it's one of those basic moves that a shit ton of Pokemon can learn, and it usually teaches you to a shit ton of Pokemon. Because, you know, depending on what game you're playing, you're going to see a shit ton of electrics. Some more than others, and Dig's pretty useful. It's like one of the very few things Umbreon can fucking learn other than just fucking party healing and curing bullshit and moonlight and crap like that, which I'm not really into, but you know. So what you could use them for in competitive and all that good shit. Don't you dare poison me, you little bastard. Hold that spell. Boss your shit up. Right now. Get out. Just get out. Cute little snake. Cute little snake. Yeah, he should be evolving here soon, too. Look at Cho. Cho's come a long way in the last few episodes. A long way. Long way. Can we, can we get there yet? Or do we have to fucking beat these two? I don't remember. I have a feeling I'm missing something, though. I have a feeling. Sneaky suspicion. That. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Doesn't that sound, doesn't that sound a bit appropriate? Oh, it's gonna you know, fuck up my attack, but you ain't gonna fuck up my special attack. So therefore, yeah, you're paralyzed, fucker. What now? What now? That's right. That's right. Take another strike. I did go and heal and shit in between episodes, like I said I was going to. Just in case you're wondering why the fuck we got more sparks if you were that attentive. And shit. It's good to see Ivy still get some fucking time though. It's, it's nice to see him get out there. It's been a while since we've used our little Mokena. Because, you know, he's cute. And stuff. I, I like calling Pokemon cute because that's what they are. I know, that doesn't sound very masculine to me or anything like that, but I mean, it's what fucking Pokemon are. Little cute little bastards. Should we? I think we're going to. I think we're going to the chance. We'll give him the chance to come through here. Give him the chance to come through, which Primate is going to have to come through when we fucking fight Giovanni, because if y'all remember, see, this is something I do fucking remember. That motherfucker has a Kangaskhan. Now, if I remember, if I remember right, that Kangaskhan is kind of a bitch. Just saying, if I remember right. I mean, we'll see if we get that far. If we get that far and stuff. But I really got no clue. Hey, look at that. Door just magically, magically disappears. I mean, that's the fucking. Oh shit, this motherfucker right here. This motherfucker right here. We're gonna save because I'm, I'm kind of scared right now. I'm kind of. I ain't gonna lie. Holy shit, I haven't saved since we got. Since, wait, or did I save after? Yeah, I saved after we Eric. Fuck. I can't fucking count. Alright, what do we want to lead with here? I think we're just gonna leave with Chode. I think we're just gonna leave it as it is and be like, you know, let's fuck your shits up. Yep. Yeah, you. You stereotyped mob boss, you. And your slick back hair and your widow's peak. And your snazzy little suit. Oh shit, it's breaking out the onyx right away. Goddamn. Goddamn, goddamn, goddamn. I don't like that. However, if shit goes awry with Grand Curve, Volcano will be our fallback plan, just so you know. I'm gonna I'm gonna just roll out to him and let him just fucking handle shit. Let him go ahead and leech seed him and shit like that. 
because, I mean, goddamn, I mean, why not? I'm talking about the kinks kind of, by the way. I guess that wasn't clear. Probably not, because I'm sitting here fucking formulating all these attack plans with this motherfucker coming up. And I ain't a... Oh, well, fucking... You got a Rhyhorn. That's right, he does have a Rhyhorn. God damn, Giovanni, you're easy. You're an easy little bitch, because this is going to be four times effective. Or at least it should. Because he's ground and rock, right? Yeah. But anyhow. That should be alright. Hey! Get ready for it. And you brought this guy! Look at that! Alright, cry chop his ass. See what fucking. That's okay. I'm pretty sure Granker's gonna. Yeah, Granker's gonna eat it right here. He's gonna take this mega punch to his little pig face. Alright, can we do it? Can we do it? Can we do it? Come on. Yeah, no! Are you gonna poach? Oh, nope. That's it. Oh, shit! Oh, bite is dark. Ah, I see what you did there. I see what you did there. Cranker. Look at Cranker fucking shit up. Look at you. Look at you. And I forgot. Dark had that whole resistance ass kicking ability towards, you know, Dark and stuff. He fucks that shit up. I forgot about that. I forgot. There is Dark in this gen. Is it technically gen 3? See? Yeah. Yeah. yeah up most chaos. That's right, bitch. I'm gonna fuck your shits up. By the way, I don't, like, really want to read this shit and, like, two voices to it, because it kind of feels lame to just sit here and fucking read it to you. I mean, you know, I, I kind of assume that people have watched this, you know, or played this game. Uh, give me that shit. I've played this game before, and stuff like that. I mean, I'm, I'm just saying. I mean, if you haven't before, you know, then, then you know, please say so and I'll try and, and make this a little more, um, Try and explain things a little bit more, make it a little more educational. Otherwise, I'm just kind of, you know, letting people kind of just roll through this game how they want to roll through this game, and you know how they think about it and whatnot. If that makes any sense, if I'm making any sense at all, probably not, because you know I don't even know what I'm fucking saying anymore. See how shit works? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. I forgot. Anyhow, I'm not quite sure when this started, so I think, I think, now let's just, I'll, I'll go ahead and head over to whatever the fuck it is, Lavender Town and shit like that, and probably get there, just in case there's anything to fucking do on the way, but I do need to take a look at Pokemon and stuff like that. Oh, you're a little fucking asshole. I gotta still do the fucking thing with these guys, and the fucking drink or whatever. He'll fucking figure that out. I think it's coming up too. But, uh, stupid ass fucking people and stupid little mechanics that seal things off to you so you can't go there. Like some jerk off standing in front of the Me Too cave in Gen 6. It's like, hey, asshole, I, I went in there and he's just standing like, whoa, dude, there's some shit in there. Alright, then get the fuck out the way. Let me handle this shit. Who is this guy? Who is this guy? Who the fuck is this guy? Who is he? Where the fuck did this guy come from? How did we not fight him? He brought this guy! He's got a fucking chode! You can't have a chode. Only well, we can have chodes. Bastard. The dirt machine out there and fuck his shit up. Want to get the dirt machine out there and just throw rocks at it? I'm like, ah! Oh shit, now he's gonna start doing this. By the way, that's one of my favorite moves. There's a ton of Pokemon can't learn it. Rock throw. It is very useful. A lot of people underestimate that. That's what I usually use. A lot of people put, you know, like, fucking... What the hell it is? Like, Stone Edge and shit on there just for the extra damage. Dude, if something's weak and you just toss a rock throw at it, I would say 90% of the time it's gonna fucking kill it. Seriously. I mean... And with the accuracy issues of shit like Stone Edge and whatnot, I mean... You know, a rock throw will do just fine. Just saying. Just a little word of advice, you know. And once again, a shit ton of Pokemon can use it. Just saying. Just saying. Just saying. It'll, it'll pretty much run house on shit. And that's usually what I put on, you know, whatever I have that's gonna be anti-flying. My my fucking surface-to-air fucking missile Pokemon, whatever you want to call it. 
Rock Throw. Rock Throw usually does very, very well for me. That's how I used to put it on like my fucking Arcanine. I think I was running on uh, like Rock Throw, Dragon Claw, some fucking flying move. I think it was Fly, actually. Don't even fucking say the word. And then, oh fuck, I don't know what else. I don't know what else I use on him. But anyway, he's my Arcan. When you toss that shit on there, he's, he's pretty much a fucking sweeper. I mean, he's gonna fuck shit up. That's all there is to it. Because he's got such high attack. And of course, he's got the dumbest fucking ability in the game. I mean, I really wish they'd take that shit out because I don't... I don't agree in having abilities that are detrimental to Pokemon. I mean, that's just dumb. Why? Why would you do that? That and, like, same type weaknesses. I mean, like, Dragon Lord's weak to Dragon. Shit like that. It's like, why? Why would you ever do that shit? That's just dumb. Just dumb. It makes no fucking sense. No fucking sense at all. I mean, fucking Sonic blew me to death over here. I think my rock probably should fucking scratch him, but... I'm trying to stay at it. Oh, actually, I don't even know if I can get paralyzed in this game. I might be able to. I don't know. Ooh, don't even throw rocks at him. We have to slash his ass. Cause he's steel and the steel should go. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. I know, use a potion, you bastard. I'm really using that fucking Sonic Boom and shit. God damn it. Fuck you and your consistent 20 damage, you bastard. Hold that slash. Get out. Not yet. Come on now. Oh, you missed. I don't know. You fucking went dive bombing out of fucking rat mess. Anyhow, dirt machine. Fucking shit up. All day. Every day. Same bat time, same bat channel. If you remember what that's from, you know you're fucking old. You know you're old. Actually, I don't even know if I got these guys yet. Get all that. Anyhow. I'm just gonna head on over here. Yeah, I fucking beat your ass and you too, you creepy old bastard. I'm gonna head on over here and fucking heal up and shit. And shit, because that's what we do. Okay, so like next episode should be the Fuji thing. Go save his ass, um, and then we'll take the flute. I think we head south and go wakey wakey, Mr. Snorlax, and then that should be probably it for that episode. I don't even know if we'll make it that far, it could be a while, but anyway, if you've made it this far on YouTube, you know what to do. Thanks a lot for watching, I appreciate it, and make sure you keep your pants optional.